Hey guys, Son of Canadian Rider. Today we're going to be testing out the DJI Mavic Pro Active Track and Follow Me features on my Ducati 899 Panigale. <laughs> There you go guys, that's the DJI Mavic Pro Active Track feature. I can't actually get the Follow Me feature to work yet. Uh, it's a bug with the Samsung Galaxy S7 phones right now with the DJI Go app. But the Active Track is pretty similar to that. And honestly, I thought it performed really well. Obviously, you have to be aware of certain conditions. You have to fly it when it's going in Active Track, you know, in an open area. It does have the obstacle avoidance in it, but still I wouldn't trust that all too much. You want to be in an open area when you're doing this. And if you're tracking objects under 50 kilometers an hour, it has no problem doing that. It'll have no problem tracking the subject. Even if it loses the subject in the camera, it'll look and hunt for that subject and it will recapture them in the active track. Um, do I think it's the best thing in the world? No. Do I think it's the one of the better things to use in a specific situation or scenario and it'll actually do the job great? Yes. So a lot of these shots here you see, it's me going around 50 kilometers an hour and it's tracking great on that. Again, if you guys haven't seen the other videos of the DJI Mavic Pro, the 4K test I did, the low light test I did, go ahead and check those videos out now. And be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel, guys. I've got a lot more great videos coming up. Again, I'm going overseas soon. I'm going to be doing a lot of cool shots with the DJI Mavic Pro, with some moto vlogs uh, of the motorcycles going through the nice islands of Thailand and stuff like that. So be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video.